Liam, uh, good news yesterday, you were on the Alter G treadmill, uh, taking another step towards full fitness. Yeah, yeah, um, back on the Alter G yesterday, back running. Um, it was only, only like, I think it was about 60-70% uh, my body weight, so it would just kind of get a feel on, on how I'd go with, with running, but um, it was a pretty positive session and uh, I'll be back on that for the next two weeks, hopefully, and then, and then back on pitch running. And in terms of the time scale of a return to, to being back on the field, what are you looking at? Um, I'm hoping for January. Um, hopefully January time, full back back in full training and then, and then be ready to go, get a good month in and ready to go for the Saturday season. I think um, if I'm on the OG for two weeks and then pitch running for, for the rest of December, um, I hope I'll get some, some good stuff there and it'll, it'll go really smoothly and then can dress, uh, transition into, into full training as well. Having had to live with the, the injury for, for a number of years now and getting get so how much confidence will you take from you knowing it's cleared up and, and you're good to go once you're back? Yeah, no, we'll obviously, um, I think going off the back of last year, obviously I knew we were going to get it done at some stage and I think now it's all been all been done and sorted, um, you know, it's just a bit of a bit of a relief really that I can, you know, really concentrate and, and actually be able to train through the week. Obviously last year I wasn't really training through the week and obviously going into this season, I, I, you know, I'll be hopefully just back to normal. I know you're, you're doing a separate programme, but there's... <coughs> A lot of change in the backroom staff as well. Has that freshened things up in, in pre-season? Yeah, no, it's really, really uh, been really good what, from what I've seen so far and, and what I've been involved in. I think Rich Onyx has come in and you know really you know cl uh, clamps his authority um, within within the squad and and the stuff he's bringing in is, is really good and, and, a, and a lot of professionalism as well. Looking ahead to 2022, being fully fit and being back out there, what are your hopes for the season? Um, yeah, just try to get some game time at centre, to be honest. Um, hopefully I get a consistent run there. Hopefully the team's pretty good with injuries and 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 everything. And, and hopefully I, I do get to, to get a good run at uh, the left centre spot with, with Ash out there as well. And, you know, hopefully we, we get some, some good form like we were in 2020, I think it was. Um, yeah, so that's me, the me kind of aim at, at the moment. And obviously new halfbacks in there in Blake and Aidan. How excited are you to, to work with those guys? Yeah, yeah, really good. Um, obviously, they know each other from from the time at Canberra, so I think them two clicking together will be, will be really easy. But, but then obviously they've got to get the combinations with the teams, uh, with the team and with with the spine and stuff. But you know they're both great players, experienced players. So you know I'm sure they'll bring a lot to us.